Oh, thousands of Catholic faithful across the country marked Ash Wednesday, the first day of the 40-day Lent period. In a message delivered at the Holy Family Basilica, Nairobi Archbishop Philip Agnolo called on Kenyans to exercise forgiveness and unite for a common cause of helping the less fortunate. Similar sentiments were echoed by Nyeri Archbishop Anthony Moharia, who called on Kenyans to take care of the environment in the wake of the devastating effects of climate change. Very own Laura Otieno has more. Pews of the Holy Family Minor Basilica in Nairobi overflowed as thousands of Catholic faithful attended the 1 p.m. Mass led by the Nairobi Archbishop Reverend Philip Agnolo. On this day, Catholics get a mark of the cross on the forehead, a symbol that marks the beginning of the 40 days of prayer, fasting and acts of kindness, especially for the benefit of the needy in society. The Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops have selected reconciliation as the theme of this year's Lent season with Archbishop Agnolo calling on all Kenyans to bury the hatchet and embrace brotherhood. We call the people of Kenya, whatever difficulties they are going through, whatever differences they, are, they have amongst themselves, let them never forget their focus on the reality dialogue. Dialogue is very important. It has brought us such far and it can take us even further into realities. The Lent season comes mark in the middle of a biting drought that has occasioned severe scarcity of food in various parts of the country. Whoa. Catholic bishops appeal for support towards efforts to deal with the effects of drought. In the moment of silence, giving and uh, doing things, we always appeal to the people uh, that they do more uh, for the fellow brothers and sisters with whom are among whom they are living. Our discussion in this country should be about climate. We cannot be knee-jerk action. Where now when the rain comes, we suddenly decide we want to plant trees, but we have not prepared. Laura Otieno, Citizen TV.